In my last Throne and Liberty video, I mentioned that Amazon is going to do an internal alpha test starting tomorrow. In that same message that I showed, the words free to play MMO were mentioned. So it looks like this MMO is probably free to play, and that of course brings the same question that we have had over and over again with this MMO. Does that mean it is likely to be pay to win? And the answer to that is of course, yes. It is hard to think of too many MMOs that are both free to play and do not have some elements of pay to win. And it is even harder to think of any Korean or NCSoft free to play MMOs that are not pay to win. So if you combine that with the NCSoft executives basically stating that they want to more or less avoid excessive pay to win and thrown in Liberty last August, it is highly likely we see some elements that are pay to win. And of course, yesterday I had a video where I talk about one way we might be seeing that with the polymorph costume system. But for me, I'm actually okay with some pay to win. There are different levels of pay to win. One of the worst cases we have ever seen is Diablo Immortal, where you can literally bypass six months or maybe even a lot more of grinding by paying enough money. Then you have milder forms of pay to win, like the old rune system in League of Legends or the WoW token. Both are extremely mild forms of pay to win, and I would be more than happy if they limit it to that. So we will definitely have to wait and see. We should know soon enough. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.